now let's go to my works okay so if i take you back after that hover over here after that i have to click on this edit element and then if i delete this let's click on add new image then i would i would love to add this image let's select let's click on open and it is going to be added and after that we have got this alternative text where we can put some other information like we can put um, website design for a client as an example after that we have got this thing image link url so it is currently selected to none but you can select an image from sorry link from here as you can see link after that you have to provide the website url so let me just take the website which um private boot to Amsterdam. this one was the url which i have done for the client so let me paste this and then i'd love to select it to new tab and cross this out now let's go back to this part we are going to click on this edit element delete this one let's click on add new image after that i'd love to add this image here so let's select click on open and it is going to be added and while it is uh, okay so just take a look uh, landing page landing page for a client okay now it is pretty simple if i select this one image link url to link after that we are going to get the url which is this one copy and paste the url right here now select it to new tab cross this out now let's cross this out and it is going to be saved now I'm going to click on this eye icon here and now if I hover over here or here we can simply click and click to visit our previous client projects right so this is how easy it is to add your portfolio designs here so you can simply make the change as you want so let's say you don't want to keep this field you can simply click on actually click here and then delete this field and you can keep this as it is by updating your image here i'm actually going to keep the four uh, elements here which is looking great actually i have to delete this whole column all right so just take a look we have got this view now